Welcome back again to our YouTube video, our channel. It's me, Lobby Lobby Lee, and it's a lovely day. So, may bago naman tayong video. And today, video is we're going to talk about the uh, short video, how to monetize in the short video. So, bagong bago lang yan lang, guys, kasi um, February 1, 2023, aprobado na ng uh, YouTube yung mga. Uh, naka YPP na or yung uh, YouTube partner program. Yung mga naka mga eligible na, yung mga nagmo-monetize na sa YouTube. So, lucky, lucky, lucky ang mga uh, YouTuber ngayon dahil uh, kung masipag kayong gumawa ng video, lalo na sa shorts, eh magkakaroon kayo ng monetization. So, meron dito uh, meron akong uh, babasahin sa Google, mga ilang katanungan kung paano nga ba mag-monetize sa short video ng YT. So, tara! Samahan niyo ako. Let's go! So, ito na nga. Uh, meron ditong mga tanong. Actually, marami ang tanong kasi dahil bago lang itong uh, nilaunch ng YouTube yung uh, shorts na pwede na tayong mag-monetize sa mga nagmo-monetize. Eto. What music is allowed on YouTube shorts? So, the answer is YouTube says its short form creators will be able to use between 30 to 60 seconds of licensed music for most tracks. However, some songs will remain on the previous 15 second limit with licensing agreement determining which tracks fall in which window. You know, alam nyo gumawa ako guys ng uh, YouTube shorts tapos ginamit ko yung, alam nyo yung parang sa TikTok, meron na rin siyang uh, built-in na music. Pero, uh, sad to say, hindi yun monetize Kasi, uh, consider siya sa third-party uh, music. So, still, pwede tayong, um, pwede tayong magkaroon ng uh, copyrighted still. So, yun. So, natry ko na yung music na yun. So, hindi siya pwede. So, pangalawang question dito. Can I use YouTube music in YouTube short? Yun. Yun din yung sagot. Hindi. YouTube short can now feature music or sounds for as long as 60 seconds. But, but hindi talaga. Hindi talaga siya pwede. Yung mga nakakonect dun sa shorts na parang TikTok na mga uh, latest songs ngayon. So, hindi siya monetize Pero dito sinasabi niya 60 seconds. As companies revise its licensing deals is earlier, the music and sounds added to videos could be 15 seconds in length. Although shorts themselves can be 60 seconds long, the feature will roll out to YouTube users on iOS and Android. But uh, November 16, 2022 answer yan. Pero tinry ko talaga. Hindi talaga. Pwede. Siguro yung mga uh, songs na walang copyrighted, yung mga nakukuha natin na uh, non-copyrighted music, yun. Pwede yun. Pero yung parang sa TikTok na mga... Um, mga music na pwede, yung mga latest ngayon ng mga Beyonce, mga uh, Asher, yung mga gusto nyo yung songs na favorite nyo, mga artists or mga K-pop, it's a no-no. So, can you use copyrighted songs in YouTube? O, oh, ba may nagtanong na. But, hindi ko siya gagamitin, pero ang sinabi niya dyan is no. So, huwag natin buksan ito dahil video yan. So, how do I, bo how do I avoid copyright on YouTube shorts. By far, the safest way to avoid copyrighted infringement and strikes is to only use your own content on YouTube. If you only use music and video that you've created yourself, you won't have to worry about copyright claims as you'll be the copyright owner. So, uh, kung sarili nyong voice yun, kung sarili nyong content yun, so much better. Diba? Dito. Can I use any songs in shorts? Hmm, diba? Pinag-uusapan natin yan kanina. Ang sagot dito, However, some songs will continue to be limited to 15 seconds with licensing agreement determining which tracks fall into which window. So, meaning kung may license yung mga ginagamit niyong songs at uh, wala siyang copyrighted gaya ng mga ginagawa natin sa normal ating mga content, mga ginagamit nating songs, so pwede siya. 15 seconds. So, can I use copyrighted music on shorts? 
YouTube has announced that short-term video creators will soon be allowed to feature up to one minute of copyrighted music in their shorts. The video streaming platform said that its short-form creators will be able to use between 30 and 60 seconds of licensed music for most tracks. So, sa mga licensed music lang. Again, so dito naman tayo sa How much YouTube Shorts pay for 1,000 view? Oh, gustong gusto niyo yan. Mga magkano ang kita sa Shorts dahil nag-monetize na nga. So, let's see. So, 8 creators recently shared how much YouTube paid them per 1,000 views. And their answer ranged from $1.61 to $29.30. So, kung meron kayong 1,000 views sa inyong video, sa inyong video na yon, so, babera kayo ng YouTube na 1.61. yon Per 1,000 views. So, kung 1 million man yan, kayo na ba alam mag-total. So, can shorts be monetized? Hmm, see? Starting February 1, 2023, creators in the YouTube Partner Program, YPP, can start monetizing their short views with shorts. Ads revenue sharing. Short ads revenue sharing will replace the YouTube Shorts Fund. So, yun nga, nag-start na. So, can I use 30 seconds of copyrighted music? Any use of copyrighted materials without permission is according to U.S. copyright law. Copyright infringement, it does not matter if you use one second or the entire song using copyrighted materials without the consent or permission of the copyright owner constitute copyright infringement. Oh, so kahit 30 seconds, it's a no-no kung ito isang copyrighted. So, lipat ba tayo dito sa Does YouTube Short Pay Money? Hmm, natanong niya kung nagbabayad ba ang YouTube Shorts ng kaperahan. So, currently, the YouTube Partner Program, YPP, is used to reward creators for short videos. Hmm. Under this fund system, the online video sharing platform dedicated a fund of $100 million for creators to recognize their creative or original shorts to build a YouTube community. So, Hmm, bam, laki yung fund. So, can I get subscribers from shorts? Hmm, gandang question to. So, makakapag-earn ba tayo ng subscriber dito sa YouTube shorts? Pwede ba siyang ma-add dun sa ating mismong uh, channel? The answer is, use YouTube shorts to promote and grow your regular channel. Every time you post a short, it's an opportunity for your content to get a view. And that view could turn into a channel, subscriber, or someone who engaged with your main channel content. So, meaning, pabor sa atin to. So, maganda siya. Kasi, mag-grow yung ating channel, madadagdagan yung ating mga um, subscriber using shorts. So, para lang siyang TikTok. So, kung kayo yung nagmo-monetize na sa YouTube, eh, pwede na kayo mag-focus ngayon sa shorts. And, uh, kung hindi ka pa naman monetize, focus ka naman sa channel mo, sa mga content mo na ma-monetize ka. Yun. Para, ma-gamit mo yung isa sa mga privilege ng YouTube, which is yung short video. Then, lipat naman tayo sa, may tatlong tanong na lang tayo. How much YouTube short pay for 1 million views? So, if a creator short is viewed 1 million times, they're allocated 1% of the creator pool or $900. The creator, sorry, the creator will earn 45% of that amount, which would be $405. So, kaya na bahan na kung paano nangyari yun. So, maybe... 1 million, then 1% ng 1 million na pupunta sa creator. And the creator will earn 45% on that amount. So, total daw 405. Balo na kayo kung paano nangyari. Okay, so let's go to the second to the last question. How do YouTube Shorts get viral? So, in order to achieve viral success with YouTube Shorts, there are a few key things you should keep in the back of your mind. Make the first few seconds count. 
Keep it concise. Create the perfect loop. So, kung gumagamit kayo ng TikTok, alam niyo yan. Rehook your audience. Give it an attractive title. Jump on trending music. Maybe yung sinasabi niyang trending music, which is yung meron ka dapat na. Or minsan, gamitin mo siya kahit na, kahit na, uh, what do you call, kahit na hindi ka ma-monetize. Pero hindi ka rin, hindi ka makaka-copyrighted. So, ano ba yung mga music na yun? Nandun naman sa load ng mismong YouTube. So, drive audience to additional content. So, may more pa dito eh. Kaso, magbibigay siya ng more. Yan. Marami pa dito. Search nyo na lang sa Google. Marami dito. Yan. What, what are YouTube shorts? So, just comment down below. I will try to answer all those uh, questions. Kung may mga katanungan kayo about shorts. So, it's a nice start of February. Pwede na tayong mag-monetize sa shorts. So, let's uh, more learn sa short video na bagong launch ng YouTube. So, keep it, keep it updated. And if you are not yet subscribed to my channel, just subscribe now and hit the notifications bell button para lang tingnan notify sa aking mga tips. And see you to my next video. Bye!